Welcome everyone to this event. It's the first time we're having this event at the College of San Mateo. Stepping up a transfer tribute, it's a celebration and a warm send-off to all of our students who are transferring. One of the things we wanted to do this year is to create some kind of an event to focus on students who are transferring. Of course, we love and respect all of our students wherever they are at, but we do feel that students who are going to be transferring at the end of every spring or at any time during the year deserve some kind of special recognition and some kind of send-off. And what I take from this moment is that we need you and we have faith in you as the future of our society to go forward and be superheroes, not the kind that Hollywood produces, but the kind that continue their education, that contribute to society in a meaningful way, and that do little things every day that are super heroic. First of all, to our transfer students, and really to all of our students, congratulations. You've accomplished a very important goal in your life. And the fact that you've made it through the first 60 units, or however you want to characterize it, in my opinion, that, those are the most difficult. I feel so strongly about transfer because every person in my family was a community college transfer student. My dad's courageous decision to be the first in his family to attend college made my life better, my, my sibling's life better, and for me, most importantly, my children's life better because two of my children have actually attended CSM and have successfully transferred, and I know it works. Everyone has a natural strength. It's just a matter of learning what your individual strength is and how that can enhance a team. The ability to take notice of the efforts put in and the outcome, that's success in my opinion. CSM was my team for three years. I traveled with them. With AGS, I spent weekends going to places around the Bay volunteering. It's been a great journey that I've been so fortunate to have shared with all of you. I, like many of you, have really enjoyed my time here at CSM and have taken a lot from the experience, so it's strange to have what feels like such an important part of my life coming to a close. But I did so poorly in school before CSM that I went through most of my life actually feeling like I wasn't a smart person and that I just wasn't academically inclined. That perception of myself changed here at CSM and that's something that I'll forever be grateful for. You made me want to learn for the first time in my life and that's a huge deal. And now I've been accepted to some amazing universities, uh, including, as you said, Columbia and UC Berkeley. I think the following message sums up my best wishes and love to you, all of you, as you continue your journey. On that trip to the Philippines, aboard a river boat on the island of Bohol, there was a banner over the boat as we got on the boat, and it said, please watch your step and mind your head. But if you miss your step and bump your head, don't say bad words. One of the examples I wanted to give you of how this changes lives is my mom decided that um, to go back to school and start her degree. So we ended up taking marine biology together and we'd shuttle out to the beach and we would compete for the highest score in the class. I got my master's degree, she got her master's degree. So it was at the same exact time. So you have that personal experience with how it changes lives. The amount of support that I received motivated me to finish uh, my two years and transfer to San Jose State. I'm currently doing uh, studying aviation and business management and I could not have done it without the amount of support and the resources that I received from College of San Mateo. It was a great experience for me. I, w I was able to even work here and become faculty for a, a semester or so. I'll be graduating next year at San Jose State and, and for all the faculty and staff and especially Mike Mitchell who always supported me. Thank you so much. The time I spent between here and Cal has been a really short journey that I would really advise just don't waste it. Go to any kind of like club you want to join, any class you want to take, because it's 
between now and then, you don't even know. You just you just graduate, and then you have to find a job. Trust me, it's possibly one of the most rewarding things coming out of CSM. The opportunity to go to one of the top universities in the world. I just wanted to give recognition to certain professors that have been really dedicated and made a difference in my life here at CSM. And one of them is Rudy Ramirez, who's a professor of ethnic studies. I've taken him, he's really amazing. I want to thank him and Professor Gaines um, and Professor Kitamura. Thank you to all the staff that have been supporting me at CSM, from our president to my OPS. Thank you so much. And another, I want to encourage everyone the life can be hard, but never give up. I'm really grateful for the student body government, for, for all the professors that I had. They have truly inspired me, and to my friends that I have made in, um, in organizations like AGS, uh, thank you very much. And to Beverly Madden, thank you so much for taking me under your wing and allowing me to work with you on Jazz on the Hill. Going into college, I don't think anybody really thought that I would be here. And it took me until I got involved and really got to know the community to really get inspired. I don't think that it was the faculty that inspired me to be incredible. I think it was the students in my classroom. And I wanted to thank you. The people who made the biggest impact were my advisors from Phi Theta Kappa. And I will forever take what I've learned on this campus and everything I've done and just move forward with it. And thank you to everyone. Thank you. Thanks so much.